home of the Ohio State Buckeyes since 1922. Before we head down to the field for the coin toss, we'd like to remind you this game is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coke tastes, zero calories. Hello, Enjoy everybody. Everything. Welcome to the Penn State Nittany Lions against the Ohio State Buckeyes. And this is game week nine. Uh, the Penn State, they have a 1 and 5 record. We have a 4 and 3. Um, so I'm not doing too well. Uh, I've lost a few games, so let's get into it. See how we get on. No matter what happens, I'm posting this, by the way. Now I'm no longer ranked, which is pretty sick. That's purely down to me being, being rubbish. Oh, wow. Nice tackle. Gary Harris, 9 yard, 19 yard return. There's no one covering that runner. So here we go. Let's um, let's see Brandon Smith. I didn't do too well last game. I got a good kick in last game. Um, so I'm going to try and do a little bit better this time. He just avoids the mistakes. And when you can do that as a quarterback and as a leader of an offense, you're going to move the football down the field. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. Okay. Let's go. Oh, I'm still going. What happened? <laughs> Didn't even know I had it. I stopped running. So Marco gets a nine-yard rush for his first run. Uh, we're just going to probably try and get the first down here. Uh, power roll. I like. I like the power roll, but I do find sometimes my guard, my line doesn't doesn't do the trick, which kind of sucks. But looks like we've got a, a man over over there. So let's see how we get on. Let's go around him. And away we go, Marco. Well done. Maybe after a nice run so it's two like nine yard rushes in the first two plays. I've seen worse. So we might have a little a little pass here, I think. We'll look for the get our passing game going. Can't just do running plays. So I'm looking for X here. Oh Jesus. Should have got intercepted there, it was terrible. Stick to what we know. Second down. Good power from Mark out there, but I ran straight into one of his guys. It was my fault. Oh. Just about impressing. Number 74 didn't even touch him, look. Craig just got straight through. He just went and blocked somebody else, so that wasn't good. Got myself sacked there for a, for a big loss. So we're going to we're gonna have to punt now. Get my D on. Campbell to punt. Down the line. So Macklin gets a five yard return. And uh, not a good start there, unfortunately. Just maybe a loss of confidence now from the, gets ready to take from the last time. It. Uh, didn't play very well at all. You know, you guys have seen me play decent, but really terrible. So Barnes in motion. He passes wide. Nice Boston takes outside. him down. Gets a four yard maybe rush, Logan Archie. Toss. Second down and six. Ball on their own 43. Tackle made at the 45 yard line. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. Well, they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. Okay, so they've got first and ten. Just want to get this. From the 45 yard line. First down. Hold this drive, slow them down. And it's caught. And they make the stop round the And got a one yard gain. Yeah, it could have been nowhere. worse. Yeah, give a lot of credit to the defense here, recognizing pass and swarming to the receiver. Man, 
Oh, ah, yes! Not sure what happened there, but I'm pretty pleased I got the interception. Let's have a look. I had the blitz on. Look at number 37. Oh, and he, he fumbled it and he picked it right up, so really good play there. Great graft. Let's see if we can turn this into a touchdown. Right from the off. So we've got a good chance for a closer in the 40 yard line or something, 39 yards to the back, so let's see what we can do. I caught with a four yard rush, rolled a few tackles, looking powerful. That makes it seven and six. It's second and six. Ball on the forty one. I was hoping just to get that drive into the third and one, so we're doing okay here. We're just going to get that halfback dive, I think, is going to be the play here, just to get into the, well, we'll try the draw, but it might be the dive if it's there. Is it there? I don't know, it's going to be the draw again. We're just going for the no loss here, and we'll be, we'll be over the line, so fingers crossed. So we're getting close to the... Actually, we're just going to let this... Probably run out. So at the end of, end of the first quarter, then no nil nil. We got done for a big sack, but we managed to uh, take the the ball back, which is great. There's a big play there, so we're doing okay. And uh, let's see if we get the dive option here. We'll go back to the back HB to the draw, the and we'll start quarter. again. I'm gonna get this first down. They go to the ground and he stopped short. Just killed him there. The fence was awful. Just wasn't even there. Look, he just ran straight through. Again. Just defensive line is shocking. So we're probably gonna be going for the field goal here. They call on the kicker for a long Gonna have to really the wind's on our back, so Ohio State is looking to go up by three. Go, 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 go. And he just ah, didn't, didn't get there. This one. And they come away empty handed. Now this one's scoreless. Just didn't quite have the legs. Wasn't far short, but it was sort of quite short. Um, They've been like a couple maybe I should have even passed it, but so just in that one. Just start to open it up horrible play with the draw. Just didn't get any sort of defensive cover whatsoever. Get him down, man. And he's taken down at the 40. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 40. Oh, missed him. Oh, my God. <laughs> First sack. So third and very long. So we're doing well here. This guy seems to give maximum effort on every play. He is so hard to keep off the quarterback. So we've lost the play here. Quick strike to the receiver. Yeah, uh, did well there. Make sure the 33 yard reception. Good pass by the quarterback. You can tell by the As you can see, I was just that about getting through, and my back guy, whoever the hell the position to play, just was late in getting on, so good play. It's first down and 10 now, after picking up some great yardage through the air. Big mm. opening! Makes it to the 14. You talk about a dual threat guy. This guy can hurt you in the air or on the ground. Horrible, horrible, horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. horrible. It's not playing well at all. He's not very good at this game. Ladder's back. They'll 
wrestle him down in the backfield. Yeah, he got a three yard, minus three yard rush there. They can get some protection. He sort of passed it off. My guy was always going for him. I got a nice user tackle in. So we don't, you know, they are going to get the, probably get the three points, so that's the problem. If we don't get the touchdown, they're going to take the field goal. So. Oh, he's through. He's taken down the seven yard line. So I expect a passing play here. So I'm going to go for the cover four. Yeah, they got him. So, so we get down. the field goal. This is um, more than an extra point. Penn State could take the lead with this field goal. And it is good. So we get three you know, points, but it could have been worse for the seven. Pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. So here we go. Let's like see if we can make amends. Off. to the 20 he's got the corner he's tackled at the 20 yard Gary Harris gets a 20 yard return maybe being a nail biter yeah this game just feels like it's going to go well into the second half probably into the fourth quarter you almost have a feel that maybe one of the defenses may have to score a touchdown so we're going to play aggressive here in a game that's this close we'll see if we can get a runner to waste possessions going free um look with Harden Carter he's wrapped up for the sack sent the cornerback and he was able to make the sack the offensive line was just too slow to pick him up by the time they saw him it was just too late i just didn't know what he's what color he was ridiculous i had no idea what his color was there so i waited and waited and then i got sacked so stupid. absolutely stupid all right let's go let's go on the back come on the sack for us again it's awful Mark Quartz gains about a yard on the play. The Nittany Lions nice taking their first time out of the half. Go for a Hail Mary. See if I can catch it and just be the luckiest player ever. Ridiculous. Is. He's going to air it long. He almost had it, but it's incomplete. Okay. Let's see if the momentum from that defensive stand carries over to their offense. Okay, come on, guy. Let's see if we can sort this out. Macklin is the deep man awaiting the return. He puts it away. And it's a great so kick. Quick. Macklin takes it to 49. He makes it out to maybe the 36 yard line. Momentum swings have been fairly so back even. on D. So struggling. This game can be struggling. drastically changed on just one or two plays. Penn State holds a field goal lead. And they got him. Oh, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman. When the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday. Defense looking for another sack in this second down and long situation. Down at the 27. Eagle, Eagle. And he tackles him at the 33. That's going to pretty much make it a field goal for half time, I think. Nice field goal. So guys, we're 6-0 down at half time. Uh, we've struggled this half. It's been a real struggle. So here's the half time show and when we come back, we're gonna rock and roll and we're gonna win this game. Great first half of action and we're hoping for more of the same. Penn State's lead is six.
we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Defense has been in total control in the first half, and you'd think maybe the offense's confidence was shaken. But if you want to look at the entire team picture, David, how big a deal is it for an offense to know, look, if we can just put together one, maybe two good scoring drives, our defense has got our back. Well, a lot of times when you know you have a defense, it's great, too, is you build your offense around it. And when I say that, why do I need to take chances? You know, if it's third and long, I don't mind throwing a five-yard pass, and if I break a tackle, I get a first down. I mean, don't put my defense that's dominant, that's great, in a bad position, and, and you can afford to be more conservative. You see it every single year. What do we always talk about here at ESPN? We talk about... All right, guys, back again for the second half. Let's, uh, let's try and do better this time. We're not doing too good. We're not doing too bad. But uh, we are struggling a little bit to get into this game fully. And uh, we need to play some good D here, get the ball back and start, you know, start moving the, moving the ball around a little bit because we're not doing that well at the moment. Right now, this offense is moving the ball, but they're not finishing the drive. They got to execute better down closer to their opponent's territory. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Logan Archie's doing quite well on the ball. They're about four yards away here on second down. Penn State with a six point lead. Woods goes with a play fake, catches it. He's hit and taken down. Five yard reception to Archie. Almost got the sack. That makes it first and ten. Believe it. He's Don't believe it. He's pushed out of How did he get through the there? Yard line. <sighs> From the 49 yard line, it's first down. It's a struggle, guys. On the run. He's tackled at the 48 yard line. But he's smacking this guy like straight into Archie Swine because he's driving his mad. From the 38 yard line. First down. He gets out to a so we got him there. Did a good one. Come on, D. Yeah, taking a party out. I want to just score some touchdowns. A great tackle at the 28 yard line. Shorter on the tackle at the 28 yard line. That'll bring up third and inches. It's third down, and they're about the length of the football away from the first down marker. Penn State up six. He gets out to about the 25 yard line. First and ten. This is the ninth play of this drive. Halfback screen incomplete, and there wasn't anyone in the vicinity. I think the ball just slipped out on him. So, guys, second and ten. From the twenty-five. What much to say about this? Minute? It's just really down. frustrating. I'm playing pretty poorly. Oh, no way. No way. 
tackle at the 13. Well, that's another first down, Brad. That's the fifth first down. Not good, down not good guys. Drop. You know, they're, they're, this offense isn't hitting a lot of big plays, but they're very, very consistent with their execution. Sometimes I find that right now this teams team. are just better. They just kind of they just get through and just make better decisions and uh, nice you just kind of seem to do anything against them. We're at the 12th play of the drive. He tackles him for a loss. I've managed to keep them away from a, an actual touchdown, but that's the only thing that I've managed to, to do. for a loss they try to counter Trey there but the defense read it nicely it's amazing the read and recognition skills of these linebackers they just always anyway, seem to have a beat ball. on the play Penn State is up by six flags are all over the place and they'll blow it dead that can't be me once you're set you've got to stay that way the slightest flinch is going to be enough to draw the flag it's fourth down. They'll call on the field goal unit here. It's up, and the field goal is good. VAT? No, field goal is not it. Now. Here's Reese Davis. Reese. The Longhorns okay, so we're down 9-0. Here's a hotly contested battle. Taylor. Not a good guy at the minute, so we're going to go this way. See if we get any joy this way. We've got a man over again. He's to the 20. And down he goes. And he's got a house. It's a 31 yard return. It's our best return we've had so far. And we get the next quarter yeah, to try and, this lead and almost determined here to try and get a touchdown and then a field goal. And we can nick it. Let's go do our best. That's all we can do. Lead it by nine. Both sides have made their way back out. And we're just about set to get going again. Run play and he'll lose yards. You know, as, as a running back, you've got to get upfield north and south. That time, he just seemed to wait and kind of no, delay no, his reaction no, and just got to be able to make a read. Our get guys to just fail, really. It's, it's just football, awful. Especially up in the NFL, the more you're dancing around waiting for a big play, the more time you're giving an athletic defense a chance to come and make a play in the backfield. Against can't you. Do. Can't do anything. They just never even touched him. There's no coverage at all. What the hell's going on? Right. Let's get the so vertical. We punt like within four players. Like I haven't got a single pass. Absolutely ridiculous. It just killed me. Absolutely destroyed us. Get through here. I'm just gonna kick off. Oh look, he's got it again. He wants it all. He's one straight through. I had to just get rid of it. How frustrating is this? Tell me, just go for Hail Mary. Go play properly, but this is ridiculous. Just carving it. Is waiting for the snap. Oh, fuck the pond up now. Macklin builds it to 41. Gets to about the 47 yard line. I tell you what, this is something Pollock could love. Crunch time and a defensive back. Well, he's sitting back at that studio loving this. Two defenses that are really imposing their will on these two offenses. Maybe they oh, can even dear. score to help I don't out. I don't want to post this, but I'm going to start with. Well I don't want to post it when I win. On this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. A gain of eight on the carry. Let's go. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Just over two minutes in the game. He's at the 30, makes it to the 24. He's going straight to us. Carving like a knife through butter. There's very little I can do about it, unfortunately. Unless I can pull some sort of crazy turnover off and run the whole distance, but I doubt it won't take him. Just 
kill me with the he fights forward to um, kill me with the Logan Archie's just destroyed me absolutely destroyed me from the 23 yard line second down let's see do one of the linemen move first Concentration laps right there. The coaches will be giving them an earful for it, too. Okay, so. Last few seconds of this match. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That's good for him. Seven yards. That, that makes, makes it first, it first and ten. ten. From the eleven yard line. First down. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Baker gains about four yards on the play. So that's it guys, we lose nine nil. Um Managed to keep them from scoring a touchdown, but uh, oops, um, just wasn't. Oh, god, it's all going good, it's all going bad here. Let's get back in here, resume game. Um, basically, just just a tough game, guys. Didn't get a, didn't get a good result, kept them from scoring a touchdown, but got to three field goals. Um, disappointed, you know. We we'll have to come lift a fight another day, so hopefully we'll do better next time. And uh, thanks for watching Renat.tv Game. And please subscribe, share my video if you enjoy it. Um, I have golf club, um, football manager, new series starting, and some more baseball over the next sort of 24, 48 hours. So thank you for watching, guys. See you next time. Sports and Kirk Herbstreit. This is Brad Nessler saying thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.